did a play um, a few years ago at the market theater yes that was speaking in Setswana. Setswana, Le Patate, there, there was yeah. a lot of who are around the fact that a first play, i mean a full-on play in Setswana will mm -hmm. be at the market theater yes for me that's what five years ago maybe uh 2015. 2015 yes yeah. i mean it's, it's 2023 now it's a couple of years but it was a lot of years into democratic mm -hmm. democratic south africa mm -hmm. yet we're still celebrating a first yes. to such a language yes let's speak a bit to that before because i in fact not even before we get into the other work you've done because mm. that's part of your work yes yes and yes. when we are speaking about wrapping up uh, as an artist our interaction with you or our knowledge of you was first from maybe a movie mm -hmm. a series that we had watched but you are, your journey and contribution in the arts has been far beyond just the screen time that yes. we have got to witness. So let's talk about that play. How did it come about and why was it such a significant moment? So, um, Moachi Mudise, yeah. he wrote it and um, he, he met up with James Ngobo, uh -huh. who was the uh, artistic director at the market at the time. And they met up at Grahamstown. And I think through the discussions, um, James wanted to do a play and uh, he, Moachi said, I have something for you. Uh -huh. And so Moachi um, studied at Vitz uh -huh. and then at some point was in the industry and at some point was like, I want to go develop my home area uh -huh. and went to Kimberley and the surrounds. And anyway, so I got the call to say, hey, this is amazing. Uh, it's a new play. It's in Susanna have a go at it and I was like yes bring it and um, I went through it and um, it was my first time reading a full play in Setswana uh. so I, I found I found a space I locked myself in this you know closed myself in the space and I read it read it out loud uh. and it fits I just it, it was an amazing story and uh, so that's how that came about and then now it was to cast it yeah and the casting process was amazing as well because all of a sudden it attracted uh. yeah to other people who yeah. wanted to, to do it and uh, Moachi came down and we spoke about it i took a trip down to kimberley to learn more about the time i went to the salt Blackie museum i went to the i forget the name of the museum of the famous photographer who used to take um, African photos of the time um, so it had a n nice pictures of that time uh. and then we took that and then we came and with the cast we sh you know, shared the pictures I shared the story and they were just on board uh. and um, uh, yeah so so and then the build-up to uh, towards it was just was just amazing uh. and um, it was so, it was about a chief and, uh, you know, fighting for, for, for power, uh. um, how they came about. In fact, I went to, 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 to the head of the Batlapin uh, uh. uh, tribe. And um, yeah, so it was, it was an amazing experience in terms uh. of immersing oneself into, a, into the Tswana culture, a section of the Tswana yeah. culture. 